Here we go. So, does branding matter? Yes. Yeah? Cool. That slide is pointless. Okay. Um, you all agree. Thank you. Um, so, if branding makes all the difference, that's probably why we pay so much more for the cup on the left. Would you agree? So my question to you is this though, why? Why do we pay so much more? Yeah, go for it. Tell. That was a real question. Yeah? I think because we come to expect a little service from Starbucks, mm -hmm. we're going to get the consistency that they provide is associated with their brand when we see the mermaid. Yeah, absolutely. Wow. I've asked this now at the last nine and no one has given me that concise of an answer. People are like, consistency, convenience. But yes, absolutely, customer service, you know kind of what to expect when you go into a Starbucks for the most part. It's not like all Starbucks will always do a great job, but chances are you know what you're gonna get from them. In terms of quality, you probably know what you're gonna get with them. What else, what else has built their brand? There's a psychological feeling that goes, it's kind of a satisfaction because people are very connected to how brands Absolutely, right? Holding this cup for some reason just makes me feel cooler versus this cup that says coffee. It's the truth, it just does, right? And they write my name on it. Sometimes it's misspelled because I have a funky name. It's always Nina, but whatever. <laughs> Nina, um, what else? What, why else? Why else do we pay so much more for that cup? I think uh, to be a part of the norm, um, just to fit in with the rest of society. Everybody's doing it, so yeah. why not? Yeah, absolutely. There's definitely some of that too, right? Everyone's there. There's got to, they've got new drinks. And also the, the about expect, knowing what to expect. How many of you are that drinker at Starbucks that has somewhat of a funky order? You know what I'm talking about? You got one, you got a few? Yeah, it's like the double tall, non-fat, extra shot, whatever, right? You can do that almost at any Starbucks and they'll know what to do and out comes the drink that you want. It's really difficult to get that everywhere else so you know what to, what to expect. So you get it, right? Creating a brand like Starbucks, creating a brand for yourself is gonna take some of those same things. It's gonna take consistency. It's gonna take quality, right? Quality over and over. That consistency is going to brand you. Yes, you're gonna have transactions. Yes, you're gonna have clients. You're gonna have times. There are times where Starbucks doesn't get your order perfect, right? But you know that if you were to go there nine out of 10 times, it's probably gonna be right. Every once in a while, maybe there's extra caramel or whatever, but they'll get it right eventually, right? Okay.